Now let's see this. So chlorination we have seen, bromination we have seen, iodination we have seen. Let's see fluorination question. Why is it difficult to control fluorination reaction of benzene or direct fluorination of alkene is not permissible? Permissible why it is not permitted or not allowed? Why? Right. So fluorine that is a concept. Let's start from there. So when I speak about fluorine, so to mean number nine, one is two, two is two, two p. Uh, if I let us write that, it's nine, one is two, two is two, two p, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, this is five, one, five, six, seven, eight. five, six, seven, eight, nine. Done. So are you not finding one lone pair of electron here? That is the main thing. So what happens? First important thing, fluorine has a, a lone pair. Okay. Next important thing, what is that? The atomic size of fluorine is very very small. Okay, done. The metabolic size is very small and what will happen, the lone pair, lone pair repulsion will increase. So lone pair, lone pair repulsion increases. So when the lone pair, lone pair repulsion increases, what will happen to the bond dissociation enthalpy? Automatically the bond repelling isn't it? Okay, let us write lone pair, lone pair repulsions increases. So bond dissociation enthalpy of this automatically will become less. When the bond dissociation enthalpy is less, what will happen to the reaction? It will be an explosion, isn't it? Reaction is an explosion. Explosion, isn't it? Yes. So what actually is the reaction with methane? Let's see. The, these are the main reasons. So how, what will happen when it reacts? Suppose when I take methane, as I said, it is an explosive CH4. Here I am going to take three fluorines. Three fluorines like this. When I take what will happen, just see this chlorine, this, sorry, this carbon and this fluorine will combine as CF2. Now, what is left out? This hydrogen, and still we have fluorines, isn't it? Jeff. Now, count how many are there? Four hydrogens, four. Okay. F. That. Now, count four plus two, six. Three twos are six. Hydrogens, four, four. Carbon, one, four. Right. This is what is causing the explosion for fluorine uh, molecule. Because of these reasons, the reaction or the fluorination reactions are highly explosive in nature. A lone pair presence. Uh, next important thing, atomic size is small. Because of that, bond dissociation enthalpy is less means automatically the reaction is very like fast and it is an explosive. Then, and next important thing what you should remember, when I conclude the fluorination, iodination on all these reactions, let's see what is the conclusion for all this. So as I said, fluorination with methane. Let us summarize the uh, halogenation reactions. So, summary is methane plus fluorine is what is that? It is an explosive reaction. Just now I told you the reason. Methane, fluorine, chlorine. It is easy to form. So, it undergoes free radical mechanism or free radical halogenation. When I take a bromine, bromine, it is also free radical but very slow reactions compared to chlorine. Last but not the least, when I take iodine, there is no reaction only. I told you, isn't it? It is a reversible reaction. It goes, so we prevent it using uh, the uh, oxidizing agent. So forward, directly it will not combine, but I said, we will write no reaction, no, we will write use of oxidizing agents. What are the oxidizing agents which we have taken? HiO3 and HnO3.